The monarchs are pretty amazing. These guys, they weigh less than a paperclip and they fly 3,900 miles to Mexico. You know, they have chunks of their wings missing. If you realize what they have to go through to survive, you would have a deeper appreciation for our efforts in trying to save them. Over the past two decades, we've seen a, a large decrease in the monarch population. Monarchs are in a crisis. Adult monarch butterflies, they can rely on a lot of nectar-bearing plants, but the actual caterpillars themselves, once they hatch, they immediately need to start eating species of milkweed. The monarchs are losing their breeding habitat that has the milkweed and all the pollinator plants across North America. So I decided to grow milkweed and see if I could attract it to my yard, and I was successful. You can see that the milkweed is in bloom right now, so it's attracting all sorts of bees and butterflies. Some kind of even little water source here. I had monarchs laying eggs, and that first summer I found 70 eggs in this garden. But I turned wasted space into this miracle that still will attract a monarch. Young Living got inspiration from Rachel Taylor to help conserve the monarch butterflies. Tyler from Young Living asked how he could get involved and so I shared some seeds and he has also gathered seeds and he has been adding way stations at different facilities of Young Living. So this is a large stand of showy milkweed that we planted a few years ago. A lot of people are making great efforts in their own backyards, but Young Living can do this at a larger scale with our great farms that we have. Since 2019, Young Living has registered four official Monarch Way stations with the intent of registering more at some of our other farms and other locations. It's great to be a piece in this puzzle of fixing this problem, but really that puzzle gets solved if everybody participates. Um, and it doesn't matter at what level, if they can only you know, devote a small piece of land or their whole garden to these type of efforts, any little bit can help. You know, all of the products that Young Living produces, we're receiving a great gift from the earth, and it's great to be part of these projects that really give back to the earth as well.